The internet is a big place. You can literally find anything on there. Now, I'm not just talking about the normal websites like YouTube, Instagram, Twitter, and etc. You can also see gore, live camera feeds, or even hear the last words of pilots before they died. In this video, I'll be talking about the strangest websites on the internet. When you visit this website, a random picture of a person will pop up. Now remember the title of the website. This person does not exist. So every image of a person you see on this website supposedly does not exist. However, each time you refresh the page, a new person pops up. These images were possibly made by an AI or any type of auto-generated faces. PlaneCrashInfo.com now, if you have never been on a plane before, chances are this website is going to ruin your life on planes. This is a pretty dark website, judging by the name Plane Crash Info. On this website, you can actually hear the last words of the pilots before the plane crashed. If you are sensitive to that stuff, you don't need to hear it, you can also read it. You can also see the date it happened and what flight number it was. This website is not so dark, but rather somewhat cool, but if you have epilepsy, it's best not to visit this site. This site is filled with a bunch of random images just scattered across the screen. However, if you refresh, you can see some new images all over the screen again. Now, if you scroll down, you could see four random shapes that are actually clickable. If you click one of these shapes, it takes you to a website where you could buy NFTs of whichever shape you clicked on, which I'm guessing is pretty expensive. This website has almost nothing to it. When you visit this website, it just shows you the name in colorful letters. You can also hear someone say that you can do anything at Zombo.com. Welcome to Zombo.com. You can do anything at Zombo.com. Anything at all. The only limit is yourself. Welcome to Zombo.com. Now, if you're afraid of being watched, and if you have a camera inside your house, which I don't know why it would be inside, and if your camera does not have a password protecting it, you could be on this website with possibly already a viewer watching you. Yeah, creepy. Once you visit this website, you can sort live cameras by manufacturers, countries, places, cities, and time zones. When you click on places, you can actually view houses. Probably not the inside, because like I said, I don't know why the camera would be on the inside. If you see yourself on this website, they said that you can easily contact them and they would remove your camera off their website, which I'm guessing they get that a lot because who wants to be on this website? Don't visit this website if you don't like disgusting videos. This website was created in 2015 and it's kind of like a challenge where you have to watch a catalog of disgusting videos and make it to the end. When you start off the challenge, the videos get worse and worse. However, the worst part is, you can't skip any of the videos. You have to watch the whole video in order to go to the next one. So yeah, do not visit this website if you're sensitive to that kind of stuff. Now, I know this may be hard to believe, but this website can possibly kill you. If you're prone to seizures, then don't visit the site. This website is a place where flashing gore images that will appear all over your screen. One of the images is a man that got his face mauled off by a bear. Hopefully they didn't get demonetized saying that. There's also a video that plays in the middle where a guy has a metal rod and he's spinning it inside his, uh, thing. All while loud screaming is being played. Now I remember visiting that site for the first time and I couldn't sleep that same night. I don't know why I visited that site in the first place. I was probably just filled with curiosity. However, the worst part about this site is that it automatically goes to full screen and when you try to exit the site, you get this message saying, are you sure you want to leave? Which was a troll created by the creator. Ever wanted to see people's birth and death in real time for some reason? Well, this website is just for you. 
This website shows you a map of the whole world that locates the exact place where a person either died or was born. If you don't want to see the deaths, you can uncheck all of them except show births, which is not unsettling at all. But if you do want to be unsettled, then leave everything unchecked except for show deaths. Now, you probably already know what this website is all about, judging by the title. It's pretty self-explanatory. This website was created by Jonathan Camboris back in 2006. This shows information about prisoners or serial killers and their last meal before they died, which is pretty dark. Now, this is not weird. It's just pretty terrifying. Lamando is basically a horror game on a website. This game does have jump scares. So if you're into that stuff, visit this website. I'll show you a clip of how the game looks like. Yeah, creepy. 